What changed, if anything, defensively to get the stops in the fourth quarter that you guys had not been getting as they built the 15th round? Uh, we got stopped. We started off getting stopped. We had a lead, crazy point lead ourselves. And we relaxed and uh, didn't lock in defensively for 48 minutes. Is that just part of the process early in the season, or is it a concern about something this team can develop, will develop? Um, no, it's, it's a process. We know we can do it. We've seen it. Uh, we did it tonight. We just didn't do it for the whole game. Mm-hmm. When, when the shots aren't falling from the outside the way they were for you guys tonight, did you, you know, were you finding trouble finding other opportunities to get in the lane because they were able to pack in a little more? No. You go with the shots, generally, that you guys are getting on threes? They're wide open. You got to make them. But we live in, we, we can't, you know, come in and talk about after the game how we have such a good game when we make them, when we miss them, we can't go back on what we do. That's what we do. When you say there's, it's a process, is there a sense of confidence after several weeks now together that you guys know your potential and how high you can go? Definitely, for sure. Um, after some time and figuring things out, uh, we'll definitely keep our heads up and moving forward. Do, do you see already the, this team, like the level you can reach this year? Definitely, for sure. And what is that level? Do you? It's only one level to get to. Okay, that's the winning championship. So you feel you guys have that potential right, right, right now? You know oh, you know. can get there. I know. Okay. Uh, is there a sense of urgency, sort of? Because you <laughs> no, know. no, no. Game four, man. <laughs> <laughs> Can't no, but you can't win shit right now. It's so, so good for in terms of the, the whole season that you, you need to get there this year. No, one game at a time. Okay. With Kyrie now, is there a different feel in Brooklyn now in this building? Um, I mean, I'm not really sure. I honestly don't pay much mind to it while I'm playing, but I mean, obviously, the, the team and with him and Katie coming here definitely brings some excitement to, to Brooklyn. Aside from the wins, obviously, what's the most important thing on these road trips? Are you together and the chemistry? You just named it. All of those. <laughs> Are you having fun? Always. Okay. Always. It's the best part of this game. Uh, have fun. Enjoy it. Uh, embrace it. Be thankful. Be blessed. Connect for a better job. Hey, I know hey, people ask you every day about you and James, but. Obviously, you guys were different players when you were playing together. Now that you have a few games on the far under your belt and um, having evolved as players, what's the difference playing together now versus earlier? Same thing, man. We 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 gonna figure it out. We're fine. Uh, we know how to play with, play with uh, each other on the floor and understand what we like to do. So we we fit perfectly fine. But you know, I've heard uh, you know fans love to kind of sometimes get out to your stats, how you're doing in the games, and you seem to really enjoy the way you play. You ever had any fans tell you, hey, you're on my fantasy team, thank you for that great game tonight, anything like that? I hear a bunch of nonsense in the stands. If you want to go down the list, you can go down there. Uh, but honestly, the world doesn't really change nothing for me because at the end of the game, I'm going to go home to my family, my kids. Um, be blessed, be thankful, and I got a job. Um, I don't really know what's going on. A lot of people's lives in the stands, what they yell out, um, but it doesn't change anything that I do, how I do it, and when I do it, um, just go out and compete. But, you know, if they talking to me, they must be talking for a reason. <laughs>